Um, Prop 24. So uh, Prop 24, it protects consumers, at least that's what they say on their ballot initiative statement. Um, it protects private information from being distributed without your knowledge. Um, business groups uh, oppose it, consumer groups support it. Can you, make help, can you help us make sense of it? Uh, yeah, business groups uh, support, uh, I think business groups actually oppose this, tech business opposes it. Um, individuals and some some community organizers and elected officials support it. This is an attempt of a uh, an, of an individual who wants to push consumer protection to continue to stand up more of them and to examine how pervasive uh, the use of data is and what Californians should come to expect with protecting their data. That's really the question. It's so complicated. You can't really say it in short order. So more data protections is a yes vote. Uh, existing data protections or less is a no vote. I don't think we're going to see a lot less because the consensus is becoming that there need to be very, very stringent protections on data with data breaches and the like. The question is whether or not this is it, whether or not it should be done in the legislature versus a vote of the people, as is common with many of the initiatives we've discussed already. And is this being backed by any one major person who put this on the ballot? Yeah, uh -huh. uh, I can't remember the individual's name, a wealthy individual is the primary bank roller for this. Okay. 